こんにちは。英語のシャドーイング練習教室へようこそ。司会のシャドウです。ここでは役立つ英会話を練習してネイティブ英語を身につけよう。日常生活で使える英語フレーズを10個、10回ずつ読み上げるから、その後に声に出して10回練習しよう。それじゃあ、始めるよう。Jordan, I've been thinking a lot about the power of words lately, especially those that resonate deeply with us. What makes certain phrases or statements so impactful? Jordan, I've been thinking a lot about the power of words lately, especially those that resonate deeply with us. What makes certain phrases or statements so impactful? Jordan, I've been thinking a lot about the power of words lately, especially those that resonate deeply with us. What makes certain phrases or statements so impactful? Jordan, I've been thinking a lot about the power of words lately, especially those that resonate deeply with us. What makes certain phrases or statements so impactful? Jordan, I've been thinking a lot about the power of words lately, especially those that resonate deeply with us. What makes certain phrases or statements so impactful? Jordan, I've been thinking a lot about the power of words lately, especially those that resonate deeply with us. What makes certain phrases or statements so impactful? Jordan, I've been thinking a lot about the power of words lately, especially those that resonate deeply with us. What makes certain phrases or statements so impactful? Jordan, I've been thinking a lot about the power of words lately, especially those that resonate deeply with us. What makes certain phrases or statements so impactful? Jordan, I've been thinking a lot about the power of words lately, especially those that resonate deeply with us. What makes certain phrases or statements so impactful? Jordan, I've been thinking a lot about the power of words lately, especially those that resonate deeply with us. What makes certain phrases or statements so impactful? That's a great question, Alex. Words that resonate or touch the heart often share certain characteristics. They usually convey emotions effectively, connect with universal experiences, or inspire action and change. They can be simple, yet profound, and often capture complex emotions succinctly. That's a great question, Alex. Words that resonate or touch the heart often share certain characteristics. They usually convey emotions effectively, connect with universal experiences, or inspire action and change. They can be simple, 
yet profound, and often capture complex emotions succinctly. That's a great question, Alex. Words that resonate or touch the heart often share certain characteristics. They usually convey emotions effectively, connect with universal experiences, or inspire action and change. They can be simple, yet profound, and often capture complex emotions succinctly. That's a great question, Alex. Words that resonate or touch the heart often share certain characteristics. They usually convey emotions effectively, connect with universal experiences, or inspire action and change. They can be simple, yet profound, and often capture complex emotions succinctly. That's a great question, Alex. Words that resonate or touch the heart often share certain characteristics. They usually convey emotions effectively, connect with universal experiences, or inspire action and change. They can be simple, yet profound, and often capture complex emotions succinctly. That's a great question, Alex. Words that resonate or touch the heart often share certain characteristics. They usually convey emotions effectively, connect with universal experiences, or inspire action and change. They can be simple, yet profound, and often capture complex emotions succinctly. That's a great question, Alex. Words that resonate or touch the heart often share certain characteristics. They usually convey emotions effectively, connect with universal experiences, or inspire action and change. They can be simple, yet profound, and often capture complex emotions succinctly. That's a great question, Alex. Words that resonate or touch the heart often share certain characteristics. They usually convey emotions effectively, connect with universal experiences, or inspire action and change. They can be simple, yet profound, and often capture complex emotions succinctly. That's a great question, Alex. Words that resonate or touch the heart often share certain characteristics. They usually convey emotions effectively, connect with universal experiences, or inspire action and change. They can be simple, yet profound, and often capture complex emotions succinctly.
That's a great question, Alex. Words that resonate or touch the heart often share certain characteristics. They usually convey emotions effectively, connect with universal experiences, or inspire action and change. They can be simple, yet profound, and often capture complex emotions succinctly. Can you give examples of phrases that are known for their emotional impact? Certainly. Consider phrases like Martin Luther King Jr.'s I have a dream or love is the only force capable of transforming an enemy into a friend. Can you give examples of phrases that are known for their emotional impact? Certainly. Consider phrases like Martin Luther King Jr.'s I have a dream or love is the only force capable of transforming an enemy into a friend. Can you give examples of phrases that are known for their emotional impact? Certainly. Consider phrases like Martin Luther King Jr.'s I have a dream or love is the only force capable of transforming an enemy into a friend. Can you give examples of phrases that are known for their emotional impact? Certainly. Consider phrases like Martin Luther King Jr.'s I have a dream or love is the only force capable of transforming an enemy into a friend. Can you give examples of phrases that are known for their emotional impact? Certainly. Consider phrases like Martin Luther King Jr.'s I have a dream or love is the only force capable of transforming an enemy into a friend. Can you give examples of phrases that are known for their emotional impact? Certainly. Consider phrases like Martin Luther King Jr.'s I have a dream or love is the only force capable of transforming an enemy into a friend. Can you give examples of phrases that are known for their emotional impact? Certainly. Consider phrases like Martin Luther King Jr.'s I have a dream or love is the only force capable of transforming an enemy into a friend. Can you give examples of phrases that are known for their emotional impact? Certainly. Consider phrases like Martin Luther King Jr.'s I have a dream or love is the only force capable of transforming an enemy into a friend. Can you give examples of phrases that are known for their emotional impact? Certainly. Consider phrases like Martin Luther King Jr.'s I have a dream or love is the only force capable of transforming an enemy into a friend.
Can you give examples of phrases that are known for their emotional impact? Certainly. Consider phrases like Martin Luther King Jr.'s I have a dream or love is the only force capable of transforming an enemy into a friend. These statements are powerful because they speak to aspirations and core human values like equality and love. Another example is, never give up, a simple yet profound encouragement that resonates with the universal human experience of struggle and perseverance. These statements are powerful because they speak to aspirations and core human values like equality and love. Another example is, never give up, a simple yet profound encouragement that resonates with the universal human experience of struggle and perseverance. These statements are powerful because they speak to aspirations and core human values like equality and love. Another example is, never give up, a simple yet profound encouragement that resonates with the universal human experience of struggle and perseverance. These statements are powerful because they speak to aspirations and core human values like equality and love. Another example is, never give up, a simple yet profound encouragement that resonates with the universal human experience of struggle and perseverance. These statements are powerful because they speak to aspirations and core human values like equality and love. Another example is, never give up, a simple yet profound encouragement that resonates with the universal human experience of struggle and perseverance. These statements are powerful because they speak to aspirations and core human values like equality and love. Another example is, never give up, a simple yet profound encouragement that resonates with the universal human experience of struggle and perseverance. These statements are powerful because they speak to aspirations and core human values like equality and love. Another example is, never give up, a simple yet profound encouragement that resonates with the universal human experience of struggle and perseverance. These statements are powerful because they speak to aspirations and core human values like equality and love. Another example is, never give up, a simple yet profound encouragement that resonates with the universal human experience of struggle and perseverance. These statements are powerful because they speak to aspirations and core human values like equality and love. Another example is, never give up, 
a simple yet profound encouragement that resonates with the universal human experience of struggle and perseverance. These statements are powerful because they speak to aspirations and core human values like equality and love. Another example is, never give up, a simple yet profound encouragement that resonates with the universal human experience of struggle and perseverance. How do cultural contexts influence the impact of these words? Cultural context is crucial. Words or phrases resonate differently across cultures because they tap into specific values, historical memories, or shared experiences that are unique to each culture. How do cultural contexts influence the impact of these words? Cultural context is crucial. Words or phrases resonate differently across cultures because they tap into specific values, historical memories, or shared experiences that are unique to each culture. How do cultural contexts influence the impact of these words? Cultural context is crucial. Words or phrases resonate differently across cultures because they tap into specific values, historical memories, or shared experiences that are unique to each culture. How do cultural contexts influence the impact of these words? Cultural context is crucial. Words or phrases resonate differently across cultures because they tap into specific values, historical memories, or shared experiences that are unique to each culture. How do cultural contexts influence the impact of these words? Cultural context is crucial. Words or phrases resonate differently across cultures because they tap into specific values, historical memories, or shared experiences that are unique to each culture. How do cultural contexts influence the impact of these words? Cultural context is crucial. Words or phrases resonate differently across cultures because they tap into specific values, historical memories, or shared experiences that are unique to each culture. How do cultural contexts influence the impact of these words? Cultural context is crucial. Words or phrases resonate differently across cultures because they tap into specific values, historical memories, or shared experiences that are unique to each culture.
How do cultural contexts influence the impact of these words? Cultural context is crucial. Words or phrases resonate differently across cultures because they tap into specific values, historical memories, or shared experiences that are unique to each culture. How do cultural contexts influence the impact of these words? Cultural context is crucial. Words or phrases resonate differently across cultures because they tap into specific values, historical memories, or shared experiences that are unique to each culture. How do cultural contexts influence the impact of these words? Cultural context is crucial. Words or phrases resonate differently across cultures because they tap into specific values, historical memories, or shared experiences that are unique to each culture. For instance, the phrase, remember the Alamo, has a significant historical and emotional connotation in the United States, particularly in Texas, embodying themes of bravery and sacrifice for freedom. For instance, the phrase, remember the Alamo, has a significant historical and emotional connotation in the United States, particularly in Texas, embodying themes of bravery and sacrifice for freedom. For instance, the phrase, remember the Alamo, has a significant historical and emotional connotation in the United States, particularly in Texas, embodying themes of bravery and sacrifice for freedom. For instance, the phrase, remember the Alamo, has a significant historical and emotional connotation in the United States, particularly in Texas, embodying themes of bravery and sacrifice for freedom. For instance, the phrase, remember the Alamo, has a significant historical and emotional connotation in the United States, particularly in Texas, embodying themes of bravery and sacrifice for freedom. For instance, the phrase, remember the Alamo, has a significant historical and emotional connotation in the United States, particularly in Texas, embodying themes of bravery and sacrifice for freedom. For instance, the phrase, remember the Alamo, has a significant historical and emotional connotation in the United States, particularly in Texas, embodying themes of bravery and sacrifice for freedom. For instance, the phrase, remember the Alamo, has a significant historical and emotional connotation in the United States, particularly in Texas, embodying themes of bravery and sacrifice for freedom.
For instance, the phrase, remember the Alamo, has a significant historical and emotional connotation in the United States, particularly in Texas, embodying themes of bravery and sacrifice for freedom. For instance, the phrase, remember the Alamo, has a significant historical and emotional connotation in the United States, particularly in Texas, embodying themes of bravery and sacrifice for freedom. That makes sense. How about personal impact? Why do certain words resonate more with one person than another? Personal experiences and values play a big role. Words that align with an individual's experiences, values, or current life situation are more likely to strike a chord. For example, someone who values bravery might be deeply moved by quotes about courage, while someone who values compassion might find phrases about kindness more impactful. That makes sense. How about personal impact? Why do certain words resonate more with one person than another? Personal experiences and values play a big role. Words that align with an individual's experiences, values, or current life situation are more likely to strike a chord. For example, someone who values bravery might be deeply moved by quotes about courage, while someone who values compassion might find phrases about kindness more impactful. That makes sense. How about personal impact? Why do certain words resonate more with one person than another? Personal experiences and values play a big role. Words that align with an individual's experiences, values, or current life situation are more likely to strike a chord. For example, someone who values bravery might be deeply moved by quotes about courage, while someone who values compassion might find phrases about kindness more impactful. That makes sense. How about personal impact? Why do certain words resonate more with one person than another? Personal experiences and values play a big role. Words that align with an individual's experiences, values, or current life situation are more likely to strike a chord. For example, someone who values bravery might be deeply moved by quotes about courage, while someone who values compassion might find phrases about kindness more impactful. That makes sense. How about personal impact? 
Why do certain words resonate more with one person than another? Personal experiences and values play a big role. Words that align with an individual's experiences, values, or current life situation are more likely to strike a chord. For example, someone who values bravery might be deeply moved by quotes about courage, while someone who values compassion might find phrases about kindness more impactful. That makes sense. How about personal impact? Why do certain words resonate more with one person than another? Personal experiences and values play a big role. Words that align with an individual's experiences, values, or current life situation are more likely to strike a chord. For example, someone who values bravery might be deeply moved by quotes about courage, while someone who values compassion might find phrases about kindness more impactful. That makes sense. How about personal impact? Why do certain words resonate more with one person than another? Personal experiences and values play a big role. Words that align with an individual's experiences, values, or current life situation are more likely to strike a chord. For example, someone who values bravery might be deeply moved by quotes about courage, while someone who values compassion might find phrases about kindness more impactful. That makes sense. How about personal impact? Why do certain words resonate more with one person than another? Personal experiences and values play a big role. Words that align with an individual's experiences, values, or current life situation are more likely to strike a chord. For example, someone who values bravery might be deeply moved by quotes about courage, while someone who values compassion might find phrases about kindness more impactful. That makes sense. How about personal impact? Why do certain words resonate more with one person than another? Personal experiences and values play a big role. Words that align with an individual's experiences, values, or current life situation are more likely to strike a chord. For example, someone who values bravery might be deeply moved by quotes about courage, while someone who values compassion might find phrases about kindness more impactful. That makes sense. How about personal impact? 
Why do certain words resonate more with one person than another? Personal experiences and values play a big role. Words that align with an individual's experiences, values, or current life situation are more likely to strike a chord. For example, someone who values bravery might be deeply moved by quotes about courage, while someone who values compassion might find phrases about kindness more impactful. Are there techniques in literature or speech that enhance the emotional impact of words? Yes, several techniques can amplify the impact. Metaphors and similes make abstract concepts more tangible and relatable. Repetition can reinforce a message and make it more memorable, as seen in many famous speeches. The rhythm and pace of how words are delivered also play a crucial role in their impact, which is why poetry and well-crafted speeches are often so moving. Are there techniques in literature or speech that enhance the emotional impact of words? Yes, several techniques can amplify the impact. Metaphors and similes make abstract concepts more tangible and relatable. Repetition can reinforce a message and make it more memorable, as seen in many famous speeches. The rhythm and pace of how words are delivered also play a crucial role in their impact, which is why poetry and well-crafted speeches are often so moving. Are there techniques in literature or speech that enhance the emotional impact of words? Yes, several techniques can amplify the impact. Metaphors and similes make abstract concepts more tangible and relatable. Repetition can reinforce a message and make it more memorable, as seen in many famous speeches. The rhythm and pace of how words are delivered also play a crucial role in their impact, which is why poetry and well-crafted speeches are often so moving. Are there techniques in literature or speech that enhance the emotional impact of words? Yes, several techniques can amplify the impact. Metaphors and similes make abstract concepts more tangible and relatable. Repetition can reinforce a message and make it more memorable, as seen in many famous speeches. The rhythm and pace of how words are delivered also play a crucial role in their impact, which is why poetry and well-crafted speeches are often so moving.
Are there techniques in literature or speech that enhance the emotional impact of words? Yes, several techniques can amplify the impact. Metaphors and similes make abstract concepts more tangible and relatable. Repetition can reinforce a message and make it more memorable, as seen in many famous speeches. The rhythm and pace of how words are delivered also play a crucial role in their impact, which is why poetry and well-crafted speeches are often so moving. Are there techniques in literature or speech that enhance the emotional impact of words? Yes, several techniques can amplify the impact. Metaphors and similes make abstract concepts more tangible and relatable. Repetition can reinforce a message and make it more memorable, as seen in many famous speeches. The rhythm and pace of how words are delivered also play a crucial role in their impact, which is why poetry and well-crafted speeches are often so moving. Are there techniques in literature or speech that enhance the emotional impact of words? Yes, several techniques can amplify the impact. Metaphors and similes make abstract concepts more tangible and relatable. Repetition can reinforce a message and make it more memorable, as seen in many famous speeches. The rhythm and pace of how words are delivered also play a crucial role in their impact, which is why poetry and well-crafted speeches are often so moving. Are there techniques in literature or speech that enhance the emotional impact of words? Yes, several techniques can amplify the impact. Metaphors and similes make abstract concepts more tangible and relatable. Repetition can reinforce a message and make it more memorable, as seen in many famous speeches. The rhythm and pace of how words are delivered also play a crucial role in their impact, which is why poetry and well-crafted speeches are often so moving. Are there techniques in literature or speech that enhance the emotional impact of words? Yes, several techniques can amplify the impact. Metaphors and similes make abstract concepts more tangible and relatable. Repetition can reinforce a message and make it more memorable, as seen in many famous speeches. The rhythm and pace of how words are delivered also play a crucial role in their impact, which is why poetry and well-crafted speeches are often so moving.
Are there techniques in literature or speech that enhance the emotional impact of words? Yes, several techniques can amplify the impact. Metaphors and similes make abstract concepts more tangible and relatable. Repetition can reinforce a message and make it more memorable, as seen in many famous speeches. The rhythm and pace of how words are delivered also play a crucial role in their impact, which is why poetry and well-crafted speeches are often so moving. How can I use this understanding in my own writing or speaking? To make your words resonate, start by being clear about the emotion or message you want to convey. Understand your audience's values and experiences, and tailor your words to align with them. Use storytelling elements to make your message relatable and memorable. And don't underestimate the power of simplicity. A clear, concise statement often has the most profound impact. How can I use this understanding in my own writing or speaking? To make your words resonate, start by being clear about the emotion or message you want to convey. Understand your audience's values and experiences, and tailor your words to align with them. Use storytelling elements to make your message relatable and memorable. And don't underestimate the power of simplicity. A clear, concise statement often has the most profound impact. How can I use this understanding in my own writing or speaking? To make your words resonate, start by being clear about the emotion or message you want to convey. Understand your audience's values and experiences, and tailor your words to align with them. Use storytelling elements to make your message relatable and memorable. And don't underestimate the power of simplicity. A clear, concise statement often has the most profound impact. How can I use this understanding in my own writing or speaking? To make your words resonate, start by being clear about the emotion or message you want to convey. Understand your audience's values and experiences, and tailor your words to align with them. Use storytelling elements to make your message relatable and memorable. And don't underestimate the power of simplicity. A clear, concise statement often has the most profound impact. How can I use this understanding in my own writing or speaking? To make your words resonate, start by being clear about the emotion or message you want to convey. Understand your audience's values and experiences, and tailor your words to align with them. Use storytelling elements to make your message relatable and memorable. And don't underestimate the power of simplicity. 
a clear, concise statement often has the most profound impact. How can I use this understanding in my own writing or speaking? To make your words resonate, start by being clear about the emotion or message you want to convey. Understand your audience's values and experiences, and tailor your words to align with them. Use storytelling elements to make your message relatable and memorable. And don't underestimate the power of simplicity. A clear, concise statement often has the most profound impact. How can I use this understanding in my own writing or speaking? To make your words resonate, start by being clear about the emotion or message you want to convey. Understand your audience's values and experiences, and tailor your words to align with them. Use storytelling elements to make your message relatable and memorable. And don't underestimate the power of simplicity. A clear, concise statement often has the most profound impact. How can I use this understanding in my own writing or speaking? To make your words resonate, start by being clear about the emotion or message you want to convey. Understand your audience's values and experiences, and tailor your words to align with them. Use storytelling elements to make your message relatable and memorable. And don't underestimate the power of simplicity. A clear, concise statement often has the most profound impact. How can I use this understanding in my own writing or speaking? To make your words resonate, start by being clear about the emotion or message you want to convey. Understand your audience's values and experiences, and tailor your words to align with them. Use storytelling elements to make your message relatable and memorable. And don't underestimate the power of simplicity. A clear, concise statement often has the most profound impact. How can I use this understanding in my own writing or speaking? To make your words resonate, start by being clear about the emotion or message you want to convey. Understand your audience's values and experiences, and tailor your words to align with them. Use storytelling elements to make your message relatable and memorable. And don't underestimate the power of simplicity. A clear, concise statement often has the most profound impact. Thanks, Jordan.
This discussion has given me a lot to think about in terms of how I communicate and the words I choose. You're welcome, Alex. Remember, the right words at the right time can be incredibly powerful. They can change perspectives, inspire movements, and even alter the course of history. Keep practicing, and you'll find your own style that resonates with others. Thanks, Jordan. This discussion has given me a lot to think about in terms of how I communicate and the words I choose. You're welcome, Alex. Remember, the right words at the right time can be incredibly powerful. They can change perspectives, inspire movements, and even alter the course of history. Keep practicing, and you'll find your own style that resonates with others. Thanks, Jordan. This discussion has given me a lot to think about in terms of how I communicate and the words I choose. You're welcome, Alex. Remember, the right words at the right time can be incredibly powerful. They can change perspectives, inspire movements, and even alter the course of history. Keep practicing, and you'll find your own style that resonates with others. Thanks, Jordan. This discussion has given me a lot to think about in terms of how I communicate and the words I choose. You're welcome, Alex. Remember, the right words at the right time can be incredibly powerful. They can change perspectives, inspire movements, and even alter the course of history. Keep practicing, and you'll find your own style that resonates with others. Thanks, Jordan. This discussion has given me a lot to think about in terms of how I communicate and the words I choose. You're welcome, Alex. Remember, the right words at the right time can be incredibly powerful. They can change perspectives, inspire movements, and even alter the course of history. Keep practicing, and you'll find your own style that resonates with others. Thanks, Jordan. This discussion has given me a lot to think about in terms of how I communicate and the words I choose. You're welcome, Alex. Remember, the right words at the right time can be incredibly powerful. They can change perspectives, inspire movements, and even alter the course of history. Keep practicing, and you'll find your own style that resonates with others. Thanks, Jordan. 
This discussion has given me a lot to think about in terms of how I communicate and the words I choose. You're welcome, Alex. Remember, the right words at the right time can be incredibly powerful. They can change perspectives, inspire movements, and even alter the course of history. Keep practicing, and you'll find your own style that resonates with others. Thanks, Jordan. This discussion has given me a lot to think about in terms of how I communicate and the words I choose. You're welcome, Alex. Remember, the right words at the right time can be incredibly powerful. They can change perspectives, inspire movements, and even alter the course of history. Keep practicing, and you'll find your own style that resonates with others. Thanks, Jordan. This discussion has given me a lot to think about in terms of how I communicate and the words I choose. You're welcome, Alex. Remember, the right words at the right time can be incredibly powerful. They can change perspectives, inspire movements, and even alter the course of history. Keep practicing, and you'll find your own style that resonates with others. Thanks, Jordan. This discussion has given me a lot to think about in terms of how I communicate and the words I choose. You're welcome, Alex. Remember, the right words at the right time can be incredibly powerful. They can change perspectives, inspire movements, and even alter the course of history. Keep practicing, and you'll find your own style that resonates with others. この練習はこれで終わりです。お疲れ様でした。もしよかったらチャンネル登録をお願いします。それじゃ、またね。